Hello, and welcome to this whistle stop tour of the Badger Notes app. If you're new to Badger Notes, the first step will be to create your account. All you need is your email address and the secure passphrase that your midwifery team have provided. You will use the secure passphrase as the account activation phrase. You'll be prompted to set up a password for your account and a quick access pin code, so your information remains secure while you're logged into the app. If you have used Badger Notes before for a previous pregnancy or baby diary, you want to add your new pregnancy to your existing account. Simply log into your existing account using the password you set and select Add a care record from the main menu. You will be asked for the secure passphrase or account activation phrase that the midwifery team provided for this new pregnancy. All your care records are then visible and accessible in the main menu. Once your account is set up, you'll be introduced with a quick welcome tour. You can revisit this at any time in the main menu, which is where you can also find help and frequently ask questions. If you need to change your email address or phone number on your account, you can do this in the app. Your care provider might provide a pre-booking questionnaire to fill out on the app. You can continue to fill this in up until the date of your booking appointment. After your booking is complete, you will have access to the week-by-week -week pregnancy summary view. Your maternity care provider might want to send you push notifications or emails to remind you of appointments or provide information throughout your pregnancy. You can enable or disable these here. Your notifications are stored in your app here. Please check with your midwife what notifications your provider uses, as not all organisations provide these. In the care plan, you can follow the week-by-week -week development of your baby, as well as any appointments you might have. Here you might see icons telling you to take a blood pressure recording that week, for example. You can also access resources provided by your care provider. The reading icon lets you know that your midwife has set you some recommended reading for the week. Some hospitals use the app to remind you of your appointments. Click on appointments to filter the week view to show you the weeks when you have an appointment. Just click on the appointment to view the details that the hospital has provided. Not all departments will place an appointment reminder on your app, so you might want to add a diary entry for a specific week as a personal reminder of an upcoming appointment. You can also filter the timeline to view these diary entries. Why not use the photo upload feature to upload a digital copy of your ultrasound scan photo provided by your hospital, or even to track your bump? Here you can view a summary of key events on your personal pregnancy journey that your midwife has chosen to publish to the app from your medical record. Check out the antenatal care summary report to see a chronological summary of your journey. Click a row to open an event up and view more detail. The blood and microbiology test report places all your blood test results at your fingertips. Your grow chart is also available here. If you encounter something that is not published, let your midwife know so she can get that published for you. Don't be afraid to ask. Contribute to your antenatal, birth, and postnatal care plans by compiling your thoughts, feelings, and preferences to share with your midwife at your next appointment via the conversations feature. If you have immediate pregnancy concerns or worries, don't wait, just pick up the phone and call your midwife. You can find contacts for your hospital team and named midwife in the main menu. The library feature gives you access to the entire library of leaflets and resources provided by your hospital, as well as a glossary, to help you understand any new medical terms you might encounter. No phone? No problem. You can also access your Badger Notes account on our website, www.badgernotes.co.newzealand. With the increase of remote appointments, you might want to share a view of the maternity record section with your GP. To do this, access the main menu and set up secure access details for your GP. This access will last for one hour. Check out the main menu to see whether your hospital would like your feedback on the care you've received. We hope this tutorial was helpful. Please contact your digital midwife if you have any more questions.